Hello friends! Welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna talk or we're gonna try, better said, we're gonna try NYX primer and NYX foundation. I have tried this foundation before and I really love this foundation. I mean it's one of my favorites um, but I never tried it with its primer I guess and uh today we're just gonna do that and just see how it's gonna work you know what's gonna do i was looking at it and i was like i was reading what ingredients has and it says it's formulated with skin loving ingredients like jojoba and almond oil with lightweight primer glides on like a dream for smooth looking canvas and beautiful coverage i'm gonna put a little bit of hydration first because i feel like i need that I haven't put any moisturizer or facial oil so i'm gonna go with elf nourishing facial oil first i'm just gonna apply probably two i said two drops but i apply four little ones so just kind of there we go and i got here i haven't used this in a while dr brand needle no more no more baggage so let's try this one it's kind it has an orange tint and it's always a really weird for me when i apply this but we're just gonna go with it today and see how it's gonna go for some reason i just want to try something new i mean something that i haven't used in a while yeah, that's what I don't like about this is this eye cream is kind of like really dry so I don't know if that's how it's supposed to be or whatever but I never liked this eye cream so I don't know for some reason I wanted to try it today here we go hydrating oil primer let's see what they say how much do I should I use it doesn't say how much should I use, but um, I'm going to go with three, maybe. Yeah, I think that's enough. And just push that in. I like oils. I like serums. I, love, I am all about that. For some reason, my skin doesn't like creams, so it's very hard to push any of the cream-based things in my skin. Um, so that's why. Mmm, this smells the best. Oh my god. Mmm. This smells so good. I don't know. It smells, it smells like, like herbs. Like some really... Like you go out, you know, um, like lavender, I think. I don't know. It smells so good, though. It smells amazing. I love the smell of it. But it's not, it's not, um, it's not very powerful. It's not like a perfume scented. It's like, it's like you're out in the nature and you smell some flowers around, you know, my, maybe like lavender. So, yeah. Mm, I really love it. And it goes into my skin really nice too. I mean, it looks good on my skin. Alright, sorry we had to take a break because my dog started barking out of nowhere and now it seems to be calm so we can proceed but yes it just went on really nice really smooth really beautiful um and now the pop this thing off and put it on oh my god i haven't used this in it's been almost half a year but this was my last year go-to foundation i wore this every single day for almost a year straight and when i say almost a year straight that's amazing for me because i always something that i always change is my foundation it's like i always need some new foundation when i want to try always the biggest the better the baddest the best the best 
foundation that is out there. So keeping this for a year straight, it's, it's, it's unheard of. Okay. So that kind of tells you how good this foundation is. So let's see, I'm going to put this on. What I like the most about it is the fact that I can, I can build my coverage. I can build how, how much or how less coverage do I want. And I'm not that type of person that wants very little coverage. I'm usually, I'm usually big on my coverage. I like to cover everything. <laughs> um, but yeah, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to use one of my brushes. For this foundation, I kind of want to see how it's going to go with the brush. Oh, yeah, there you go. That looks so good. And then maybe go in with the beauty blender at the end. Maybe the shade is a little bit too light. We shall see. Because I was like in between two shades. Uh, I usually, that's, I usually go for this one and another one. And... Depends of the how tan or how less tan I am. This is one of the two. So I might have gotten the one that is the lightest. Well, we'll just see. I'm pretty sure I can make it work. There is no foundation that um, matches my skin tone fully. There is no, none. And trust me, I tried thousands. None. None. I usually have to play around with the shade so I can make it work for me. Kind of like that. All right. Let me, let me wet my beauty blender and then come back. Okay, so it seems to be the perfect match once I put my beauty blender to work with. So there it is. Look at that. And look at that. I love this foundation. It's gorgeous. All right, now let's go and apply. I'm going to try something new again, or I did have this for a while, but I want to try it again. This is Maybelline New York Master Concealer by Face Studio Camouflage Concealer. And it says Camouflage Imperfection and Dark Circle. Full coverage, high resistant, undetectable finish. Let's try this. And it says to apply it with your fingertips. Okay, let's do that. I'm gonna buy my fingertips. I think I tried this before, um, and I'm pretty sure I did like it because I threw a lot of uh, makeup that I did not like, like two months ago or so, and this make it. This made it, so probably I did. I do like it. When I tried, I do like it. Okay. Oh yeah. I live in the middle of the countryside, so it's usually very peaceful out here and quiet. Unless, of course, my dog starts barking because the leaf is falling down from the trees or he hears some deer crossing the property but let's talk about this concealer oh my god wow this blending is so good just check this out that is so good that looks so good Okay, let's do this on this side too. I don't even need a beauty blender. I can just do it with my fingers and I just really love that. Because it looks so natural. 
when you do it like that. And you don't lose any any product. And there you go. What you guys think? It's so cute, huh? I like it. Oh my god, my cat is right there looking and see what, what are these birds talking about next to the window. Okay, so there it is. What do you guys think? I absolutely love this. Uh, and I will give it 10 out of 10. Like, it's just gorgeous. And look at my foundation. It's still very, very good. Really pretty. I'm going to go ahead and apply, um, apply some powder, apply some, finish up my face, and come back and show you how it looks. See you in a bit. All right, you guys, I'm back. So here is the final look at my makeup. There we go. All super cute and very nicely. It is all really nice, really beautiful. I totally recommend the both products. Um, the foundation, I already know how it works, but we we'll, shall see how, the, how it works in combination with the primer. So this is the final look. Thank you so much for watching. It means a lot to me. And please subscribe if you're new here or if you haven't subscribed yet. And um, thank you so much, guys. See you next time with another video. Bye.